What if I told you segmentation was a waste of time? Well, that's one school of thought which says you shouldn't write briefs based on your audience, but rather their needs. It's called category entry points. And in this video, I'm gonna unpack what they are and how they work and how owning an occasion might help you focus your next brief. Category entry points, or CEPs for short, is just a fancy way of saying need. A need is what triggers a consumer into being ready to buy. And it's incredibly powerful if your brand is the first one which comes to mind to fulfill that need. For example, in Australia, there's an iconic beer called VB. Since the 1960s, they've used the tagline for a hard earned thirst and consistently position themselves as a reward for an honest day's labor. If you just finished mowing the lawn in the middle of the hot summer, VB is what comes to mind first. Owning an occasion is a very effective marketing strategy because once it's established, it can generate returns for decades. For example, the tradition of buying a diamond engagement ring was completely manufactured by De Beers marketing team and it still lives on today. Thinking about category entry points can also drive growth by identifying new consumption occasions or moments where you might be able to drive incremental sales. To plan using CEPs, How Brands Grow provides the five W frameworks for generating new opportunities. In this example, they use champagne and the many different needs a brand could build equity in owning. Firstly, why? This could be to celebrate a promotion at work or to give to a host at a dinner party. Then we have the when, which could be the first thing you crack at a dinner party or for when you go out dancing with the girls. Next is where. This might be at the tennis or when you've got a private table at a club. The fourth W is with whom. You could be the champagne for when you're with your partner or when you're catching up with your adult children. And the last one is with what. Here it could be paired with fish for dinner or it could be enjoyed with brunch. So the next time you're writing a brand strategy to grow your brand, instead of thinking about your standard segmentation, consider how you could build a CEP. What new associations could you build for the brand around a need, establishing a new opportunity to increase consumption and sales for your clients? Thanks to the Strategy Finishing School member, Zach Martin, for contributing on this video.